try not to upset her or make her stress uh, any more than uh, is necessary. Oh, you're okay. See if I can, uh, without disturbing her too much, pick up one of these little uh, packages. You're okay, Mom. And here's the last little uh, bugger that was uh, born. Uh, you can see the his eye and the end of his snout just uh, sort of hanging out in my hand. I'm probably transferring a little heat right now to it, so it might become a little bit more active because it's it's. You know, 73. Yeah, I have your baby. Don't worry, he's okay. Now I have the uh, tricky job of uh, trying to take a picture of this little bugger in my hand with one hand. is to put little baby back. The um, the outside of the sack, remarkably enough, didn't leave any residue either on my hand or on the spoon that I was using. Um, see, I put it back. I was just... Uh, Taking a close up uh, look at them. Um, you know, it's smooth and glistening and stuff, but it looks moist, but doesn't really seem to be. So, with that, I think I'll just uh, close the lid because Mama's a little bit, uh, um, 
I don't know, wary now. So I'll close the lid, I'll go off to work, and uh, we'll see how many we have later. She can certainly uh, take care of the situation without me. Okay, well that's a good mom. Just uh, uh, lay your head down and, and uh, go with the flow. Good luck, have a good day, and I'll see you this evening. Oh, wait. That little uh, beastie that I disturbed that I warmed up a little bit uh, is uh, moving about. And let's see if he sort of uh, decides that it's time to come out and visit the world as it really is. Oops, sorry mom, relax. Oh, that's a nice baby picture. Hi, Mom. How many babies do you have in there? Whoa, we still got some in sacks. Are they alive or are they just uh, uh, didn't make it out of the sack? They're... Hey, guys, don't you think it's about time you uh, come out to play? Huh? Those are the... Oh, hi, Mom. Yeah, I'm mostly harmless. Uh, uh, I'm not going to hurt them, but I sort of want them to uh, come out and, and oh, look at that, boing! <laughs> That's quite an erection he had there. Here's another little bugger. Come on out. Come on out. It's time to play. I know this is a lot of work. Being born is not an easy job. Come on. Okay, now we've got to sort of move you guys aside a little bit so uh, those little guys underneath uh, can come out to play too hello oh look at him hi mom no I don't want to goose mom and get her going that's certainly not uh, something I'm interested in doing because whoa they're like coiled springs. Hey, e easy guy. Especially since mom's tail is starting to twitch. Which is, uh, never a good thing. Hello, baby. Oops. We have a baby with some problems, it looks like. Uh, yep. We got a baby with some deformities, it looks like. Oh, that's sad. That one is just not going to make it. I'll show you folks after I unwrap all these other little presents. Hey, are you with us, huh? Yeah, okay. How about you? Hi, Mom. Yep. 
Hey, you slimy bunch. Get the heck down there and uh, just hang out. No reason to escape. <clears throat> Hi, Mom. I don't know. That area right there looks like it it could contain a uh, baby, either that or it's... Well, there might be another baby in, in there. I don't know, it's really hard to say. But, um... Let's have a look at Mom. Oh, isn't she a beauty? Well... This is a, a really sad one, unfortunately. This little tyke um, really doesn't necessarily have a chance. <clears throat> He's got uh, multiple deformities from what I can see. His head is sort of stubby. As you can see, his he's all sort of wound up tight. That guy, I'm sorry. This is uh, not a happy day for you, huh? Ah, That's really sad. I'm trying to figure out what the hell is going on here. Uh, you can definitely see that, well, his, the front of his face didn't form properly, and his neck is all twisted up. There you go, bud. Here's the remainder of his uh, yolk sac and the blood vessels uh, supplying the yolk to him. He's Got some rather screwed up eyes also. I, he's uh, he's alive if you call that alive. You well know, not a hell of a good way to start life, huh there, kiddo? That sort of puts a damper on my whole day. See, he's really, really got the short end of the uh, genetic stick here. Um, you know, you can see his head. I've not seen any sort of a tongue flick. His eyes are sort of mashed in. That's his rostral scale right there. Uh, on this side you can sort of see an eye. Uh, I can think I can see one of the L'Oreal pits. Uh, his jaws aren't really properly developed. You can see these abnormalities in the spine. Uh, and his head is completely twisted right around. Jeez, that's awful. Well, you know, I'm a biologist by training, so I've I've seen all this uh, stuff. He's all curly cued. So the best thing I can, uh, the most humane thing that I can do, is um, is go ahead and uh, and uh, end it for him real quick, uh, and I'll do that with uh, carbon dioxide. But there's no reason to uh, trouble all of you with that ordeal. Um, 